This is Take Two Movie Review. I'm Clinton Johnston. This week, themes are not just for 8th grade book reports. One of the joys of the Marvel flicks is finding quality where you least expect it, like in Guardians of the Galaxy movies. I mean, where the first one felt zippy and fresh and argued that there's moral and emotional righteousness when heterogeneous groups work together against divisive homogeneous totalitarians, the second one did fall into familiar action movie central white male daddy issue land. And, as She-Hulk so aptly pointed out, they doubled down, two daddies, same issues. But I have a friend who had just lost her father who found it very moving. We all bring different things to stories and take different things from them. Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3 takes a step back from central male myopia and a step towards an ensemble film, which, yay, if only because Team Guardians has made all these great characters whom we don't want to see just as Peter Quill love interests and Star-Lord second bananas. Also, rather than having one's past trauma-generated emotional issues magically resolved at the end of two and a half hours, here we end with characters realizing they must face what they're avoiding so their work can begin. The former narrative is more immediately gratifying, yes, but I argue the latter is more relevant to our lives. For instance, Peter Quill must confront his obsessiveness. Appropriately, our villain, the High Evolutionary, serves as Quill's foil because his obsession to make a perfect world drives him to destructive cruelty. He differs from Quill and crew in that he works to gratify himself, while they, ultimately, work to better things for others. That's why Good Guardian stories, like Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3, put our heroes against backdrops of groups and societies. Guardians movies, as valuable for what they say as what they do. Don't worry, Volume 3 does a lot. There are killer fight scenes, great Groot and Drax moments, and a rocket backstory that is much, much more harrowing than you're ready for. This has been Take Two Movie Review. I'm Clinton Johnston. Catch up with us at TakeTwoMovieReview.com and feed us back on our channel on YouTube.